Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brianna and today I'm going to be reviewing for you the Flower Power Bath Bomb. Now, unfortunately, this bath bomb is getting discontinued. So if you are interested in this product, please go and double check at your local Lush store or Lush website and see if they still have it in stock. And yeah, if you like the sound of my review, definitely hop onto it and don't wait. So the ingredients for this bath bomb are sodium bicarbonate, citric acid, honeysuckle, meadow sweet, marigold petals, lime oil, rose oil, rosewood oil. So these ingredients are quite simple. It's got the basics of the sodium bicarbonate and citric acid, and everything else is just dried flowers or a little bit of scent to it. And this was my first time trying one of the cloth style bath bombs. Um, you will see in the demo, I did I did the demo a little bit differently um, in showcasing this bath bomb. So um, definitely stay tuned for that at the end. I, I don't always recommend watching the demos unless you're really into the bath art. But this demo, I really do recommend you watch at the end just to see what it's like in action. So, yeah, like I said, it was a cloth bath bomb. Um, and this had the most amazing scent it was stunning. It's definitely one of my top five bath bombs I've ever tried. And I've tried a lot of bath bombs in my time, tons and tons. Um, there was just something different about it. It was just so strongly scented. And I just thought it was very aromatherapy-like. I liked the, um, I just liked the whole experience of this. I loved the fact that yeah, you got to see this bag of just beautiful, um, you know, flower petals and things just doing their thing in the bath. I just thought that was fantastic. And the scent was this really strong floral scent. It was, you know, flower power, you know, there was no surprises in that respect. But the surprise was the fact that it was just so strong. The rose is definitely there. I could actually smell like lavender almost. Like I could smell like a lavender thing theme in there. Um, I could almost smell like a Lang Lang Jasmine smell as well. It just smelled like a very rich um, bouquet of flowers. It was just so stunning. And the lime oil, as with most slush products, lime oil is basically there to liven things up, freshen things up. So you don't distinctly smell lime with this product. It's just another one of those things that Lush does just to freshen things up and make things more um, you know, zesty. Yeah. Um, which I appreciated. I thought it was lovely. And yeah, I, as you can tell, you know, if it's in my top five bath bomb, it's got, it's got to be a five out of five. Um, so yeah, definitely five out of five. Wonderful, wonderful product. I am very, very disappointed that I didn't try this sooner. And I'm very, very disappointed that it is getting discontinued, but they do still have one other cloth bomb in their bath bomb range in Australia at least, which is the Deep Sleep, which I will be reviewing soon as well. So stay tuned for that. I will definitely let you know how I feel about that one um, in the coming weeks, days. Not sure when I'm gonna get around to reviewing that one, but I will definitely let you know. So thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate all the support I get on this channel. Please stay tuned for the demo and just the showing of the bath water and that sort of thing. And I will see you on the next video. Bye for now. Hi guys. So for this demo, I already actually have the furs uh, bath oil in right now. And I like the scent. And the color is kind of like this very light murky green. So for this demo, I'm doing the Flower Power bath bomb. I thought I would do this live in front of you. There we go. <laughs> uh, it does have a string, but it doesn't fit around my tap. So sit back, enjoy the ride.
That's all air, by the way. So that's pretty much done, only a small amount left. And the bath border is definitely more coloured now, more yellowy, kind of uh, kind of more cloudy. Just that tiny bit left there, but look at that, it's beautiful. I'm going to let this soak and I'll let you know how I go in the review. Thanks for watching.